and I haven't done tank before, like uh, since. And I did like some the most uh the bug achievement on modern because I just couldn't be asked to switch to tank. I just I was just locked in. The moment I switched it, it was like not going back. <laughs> Hey G point, cool name. Um, <laughs> uh, I don't know, but compared to original glitchless on tank, it's one twenty nine fifty five, and this run can be like mid one twenty five. Did I start a new game plus? No, I don't think so, did I? We'll see if the med is on the floor. Yeah, like a four and a half. I don't know how much, like... This game, like, if you someone ran it... On, uh... Tank. How close they would get, but yeah. No, it's it's regular. I didn't get destroyed by these rats. Fixed glitch? Uh, what glitch? I'm not using glitches. Yeah, I think TR1 will be more. But I, I am not... I'm just saying it could be. Just like this game, I think there's like a minute at least people could squeeze off if they got good. Yeah. Someone needs to get close to it though. Because it's hard to get motivation to run it alone after a certain point. Because you don't really like, at some point, like, even now, sometimes for tank, like OG and this one, like, I some some days I'm like I'm gonna try something because I had an idea, but I don't really go looking for like skips. If that makes sense, but like Yeah. Yeah, I think he got it really fast. I wanted to jump onto this up little alley. Uh -huh. Tom Boggart, yeah. I mean, I'm sure there's like loads of good runners. Just depends who's willing to practice and like run it. I know I said like I would stop after 125, but I want to get like a mid 25. Dude, I did late grab and I still missed. I love this crap system sometimes. Yeah, they are empty. I don't know if it's the same because I'm, I am very biased, but when I ran, I started running, uh, 2017, the heavily, what the fuck camera, like the heavy, like, people were really down on Tomb Raider 4 and 5 because of the glitches, and 
most people said it's the most boring shit ever because it skips so much. And like people didn't run it, like there was like only a few runners. But when I started running it, I was like, holy shit, this is actually one of the funniest and my favorite categories ever. It was so good. And I feel like Modern has a similar treatment. Not really that badly, I think, but I feel like a lot of it's like too easy, easy mode. You know, it's like not really saying don't run it. It's more like, I don't know what, but yeah. I think it will take over soon, sooner or later. Yo, Slavic Halo Run. I'm hoping it will take over. I would love to see someone crazy enough to do glitched on this and actually like learn it and like find glitches and setups and I would love to see what an optimal or like a crazy skilled modern runners could do in glitched. I think it could be wild. Uh -huh. I'm sure most people who play AOD with modern. Yeah. Alright, that's key. But yeah, I, I, I will run them, run them games. Would be nice. Uh, void strats, which are probably- I don't even know if they're possible. A uh, quap? I don't think so. I think quap could be easy. I found the Tomb Raider 2 gold co-op really easy to do. Or the co-op hold. Because I know you can't do like pixel perfect turn. So to say that you can only hold W for an angle like stuff. But one benefit of free camera is like you actually have visual. For things uh -huh. like on your tank, when you tap look, you can have missed, you can have fucked up a uh, camera, and it's not actually accurate when this doesn't have that problem. So, I think there are some benefits. Obviously, some are harder, but swim corner bugs are uh, near impossible, not impossible, but. You can't tap the turn, and when you try to turn, she goes forward as well, as well, and she like goes away from the wall. Probably one of the dumbest glitches to do. Do you think sub 125 will be happening? No, not by me at least. Uh -huh. I will hope if I can get 125, 30 something, I'll be happy. Very happy. Especially with my summer best. For example, there is a clip. I showed it to KTC as well. When I was running the gold. 
Golden Mask. There is a one very finicky glitch, which is actually not mega complicated on tank, but you have to press a lot of buttons. And on modern, it is like the easiest shit ever. Like on modern on tank, you basically have to have like a really perfect like angle for embed, then walk forward and sidestep, I think, or something like that. On this one, you can have the angle really quickly. And then you just walk forward and tap left or right. I can't remember. Right, I think. Because she turns really quickly. And she, when you press right, she also runs forward. So that makes it super easy. You don't actually have to like play any sidestep memory. But when you look at like how, for example, the setup in offshore rig is for the jump. We were like, how can we get, um, how can we get Lara to a fixed position? How can we, we can manage distance? There's always ways to manage distance with different kind of input. It's just like, who's trying them out? Like, a lot of tank setups were really slow, and eventually, people just started, like, finding faster and faster, and to this day, people are finding faster setups. So, it's not over. Hey, Big Sean, by the way. Maybe we, if I can get like one one twenty five three x, I should start experiment with glitched. That would be a nice little project. Uh -huh. It would be insane, but I think, honestly, if you're good at menuing and you know exactly what you're looking for and when, I wouldn't even be minding to change the tank, because there are certain strats which are probably impossible on modern, and the alternative way of doing them on modern is way slower than swapping even going through the menu, and it's not to say it makes the runs look slow. I think it's comparable to nowadays when people are running new games. People are switching from like 140 FPS to like 30. Because 30 FPS, for example, in RE games, messes up the enemy hot collisions and shit, so... I think it would be nice. Hey, Lord Pichun. I'm not completely against, like, mixed. Whatever is the fastest, I'll do it. And it definitely isn't tank only. <laughs> 100% cannot be. Yeah, hotkey would be like too broken, I think. Do I risk it for a small med or a small large?
for example, some of the shell bugs. Also, the oh, there's a few things I really don't like modern. Oh, not modern glitched. I'm gonna explain in a bit. It's the fact that I don't know because I have like maybe two hours max experimenting glitches. But if I remember correctly, for example, the Barcoli bar first step bug, it's much harder on these graphics compared to the. Oop, this is Mr. Click. Um, than on the. Uh, on the old graphics. I don't know why. But the way Lara, like. I don't know. It, it makes no sense. But it, it is what it is. I would I could actually try it. We should try it after the after I get a 123 X or something. That would be a nice little project. Maybe not even like run it seriously, but more like just get the proof of concept out there so people would try it. Because that's also huge. Someone has to do it first, and then people will follow it. Am I hyped? Woohoo! Yeah. Ayutame! So Sup? Yo, Brad, thanks for the 19 months. Thank you, thank you. Appreciate that. Just like people are now like switching back to back and forth with like OG and modern graphics. Um, you would be switching back and forth graphics plus inputs. There must be levels where modern is like just unbelievably OP. I don't I think I have to like downgrade my game though. I'm not sure. If I wanted to run it like seriously because or like the, not seriously running but like the serious routine because of I don't remember if they made some of the glitches impossible on these versions. So honestly I haven't looked a single full game run on this version. I kind of lost interest after the first or second patch. When they kind of reverted back to like the original way of doing certain things. That was actually low key insanely good. Uh, 80%. <laughs> Chatting shit and getting it. Nice. They do work, Jinxie, but it's they they patch something away from the very first, like the from the patch this game released on. For example, Tomb Raider 3, you can't do keyhole glitches if you don't. I think if you don't play on the newest, uh, oldest patch. What do you think about binocular skips for three? I think so as well, but honestly, my point of view is like I didn't mind the binoculars. It was the warps I didn't like. Uh -huh. 
the warps like actually they didn't kill the game for me but it made quite boring to be honest That's why I really like the restricted. It's still one of my favorite categories because it stays true to the the way I learned the game. Even though there are obviously new strats, but it's the game, the version of the run I enjoy the most. It is versatile, but also very fucking optimized and painful to run. I don't want to tell, KTC can probably tell you how insanely fun it is to throw a run in underneath the Semerk, uh, not Semerk, underneath the Sphinx. Because one fucking stupid player jump didn't work. Which doesn't have a setup other than just go for the angle you used before. <laughs> but it's fun to run, honestly. Not on a very high level though. Because you need to get like crazy good Cambodia as well. But I'm not sure if there's new strats. I'm pretty sure there are new like strats as well already. I am sort of the loop on classics. I don't know. Only thing I really know is like some Tomb Raider 3 stuff because Ice T and Gooey is sell saying that oh they are so good now. <laughs> Yeah. And when you find stuff on like what 20 how long is it? 23 minutes or whatever the game is on the run. For any percent. It kinda is huge thing because it's already so short. But yeah, I think if I had to pick like my favorite category, it is Tomb Raider 4, any percent. Three warps. And honestly, I would even say like, yeah, three warps because I fucking despised. And to this day, I really hate. Uh, I don't like train skip, even, even though I was the one who started doing it without save, to my knowledge. I just fucking practiced it too much, so I got the muscle memory, but I don't like the Semerket. Is it Semerket? I think it is. It's the RNG fucking binocular strat. Yeah, it is the Semerket. I really don't like it. You can like, if you didn't get instant like 3 second trigger, it's like run over. Nice. Yeah, I think it's if they remove that binocular stuff, could be sick. And so is this goddamn level. What is restricted? Tomb Raider 4 any percent category, where you are not allowed to use warps, which makes the run 23 minutes long. What is this? 18-3-1 Don't get too horny yet, the run is only beginning so. It, like 18-3-1 is so insanely good <laughs> beginning. I think my best is like maybe 29 or 28, but... Am I gonna try tomorrow 4? Yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I will. 
I will run. I'm I'm pretty confident. I will run more of those games than I do these. Obviously, I haven't been running Tomb Raider two, but that's I'm one trick into this game, and gotta agree, I'm not really versatile enough. But yeah. I don't know if they would let me play test the game. I would love that. Like a demo mode for like, uh -huh. or something, just for the controls itself. Uh -huh. That would be fucking insanely good. So I think I can be objective. Maybe not after you're roasting the devs. N no, I don't think the devs are the problem though. I am, I'm pretty, I'm 99.9% .9 confident. I have never played the devs for it. Especially Troye. Troye has actually fixed almost every single problem in these games. I pointed at him. It just like when they patched something else broke and because it's like one month cycles like it's hard to like fix it right but he it's the publishers who are not wanting to fix it but yeah I wouldn't be surprised if they hate me now but uh -huh. if we all suck like dev, not devs, this, uh, the publishers, like, toes and sucks. Do we ever get anything good? If we always just, like... Like, please them. Rather than them making good products. So it's like... If that's the reason I wouldn't get it, like, or any early access, so be it. So I don't want the harm for the game. I'm at least maybe I'm delusional, but I'm, I think I'm thinking for the better of the game and the players. But now they have pretty good uh, database. I think I like a, the sample size. Oh, Casper. Casper is on my, on my feet. Uh, what I was gonna say. I forgot what I was saying. I got ganked by Casper mid lane. Um, and it's not like I have been the most unreasonable person ever. I believe. There are other streamers who are disliking maybe I've been very vocal about it but uh -huh. it will not change if we just uh -huh. because like I can report every single bug or thing through uh, through um Let's say, like, an email or something, whatever they wanted, right? It's it, it doesn't matter if the devs can fix it or fix it. It's the publisher who needs to put the patch out there. So it's like, devs are getting shafted as well. Sekiro Shura. Dude, don't say Sekiro. I... It is... Oh... It is my favorite game from Souls games ever. 
it is it is the first game I ever played from that type of game and I fucking loved it. I still love it. It is I've seen so many speedruns of it as well. It is so good. I love the atmosphere and the like the the theme of it. And whenever I get tired of Tomb Raider, I'm already tired of it. <laughs> Let's be real. That's why I can only stream like a few times a week the game. <laughs> Okay, what the fuck is this run? I am 12 seconds off of my goals. I'm gonna close it. Let's uh, let's try to hard try hard this game. Half an hour in. Hard, try hard and still chat shit. The lean in buff. I actually think it hurts the most. The reason I hide splits is like I'm trying to save my mental. Hey, Dider Boy. Thank you. Because sometimes like losing 10 seconds is feels like an end of the world and sometimes it's fine. It really depends on the day. I feel like if I focus too much, the run goes bad. That's why, like, if you ever, like, watch my PBs on YouTube for OG, for example, I start to hymn or sing or yap some nonsense. Because it keeps my thoughts somewhere else, but at the same time in the game. I'm telling you, speedrunning is a mental game more than anything. <laughs> Yeah. Humming, anything is like, that's the way of, like, my way of coping with stress and nerves. I'm not gonna get nervous, like, until, like, fucking Barkin or something. But. <clears throat> Floating is horrendous for it. <laughs> it is so spooky. But I still enjoy it. Dude. I jump perfectly. And I get embed. Like, hello? Did, did you see that reset? That reset. Did you see that? I can't try to cancel my jump, but the step went through. So I'm losing all my time on this level now. Based on those three mistakes. That was the worst one. No. 
And I got the worst luck here as well. Yeah. So now there's like no pressure. This gun, this run is ass. I'm gonna put the comparison back on soon. When I have time to lift my hand. I lost fucking 20 seconds on it. I'm not gonna switch the name of that. Sure as hell didn't hit me. Corey Fathom is like uh, OG Tomorrow One, City of Common. It either goes well or you just suck dick endlessly and you're drowning on it. And it's nothing, it's, it looks disgusting and is disgusting. Like one thing goes bad, it's like it's fucking done so. Also, start the run here. Fuck, I messed it up. Oh, I still got it nice. It is a fun to run, but it's also not fun to run at all. <laughs> it's it's one of those like levels where it's, like it's fun because I don't dread the level itself, right? Like I don't I don't dread forty fathoms. I know exactly I can do them, but it's more like I just hate when it goes wrong because it will go wrong so badly, and it's just. It's fucking majestic failure when it goes wrong. Because like if I feel like there's just the mistakes, there's no way you can make a, a small mistakes. It's not a little dent. It's like a massive gash. Kaboom! Gasparate. It depends which keyhole you're doing it. It really depends on which keyhole. For glitches to pull up screens in Yeah. I don't know, I just... Hey James, it's going good, how are you? That's the, that's the reason I started doing the warm-up strats. Or like warm-up practice every time before stream. Because... Obviously I will be nervous in like floating island, but... If I can reassure myself, even if I know without practice I can do it, but I might have like a 
few day break from it, I feel like if I do the practice and it, a few hours before, it's like it kind of gives me like oh that was nice. I long need a, like confidence on it to like how to. I don't need to overthink. Let's just say that I don't need to overthink. I can let my brain and muscle memory take over. And the less I think, the better. Uh -huh. But if I have to overthink, like strat, or I'm like scared of it, I, I, I hate that feeling. So even that, the reason, like sometimes you see me do like a barking window once, sometimes you see me do it once. Or like 10 times or 15 times it's just because if I fail it and something doesn't feel right I'm gonna try to get to a point where I think I'm doing it right and that gives me like the needed reassurance that okay I don't need to worry about it in a run I can just go for it and even if it fails it doesn't fail because I was scared or I didn't know what I'm doing Dude, how did you bonk? I don't... I want to have the frame on that. <clears throat> hey, man. Inspector, what up? Nothing is worse than your mind playing tricks on you, like... An hour into a run and you start overthinking something that is the worst i have been there i don't want to be there i will be there it's like i'm just trying to avoid it as many times as possible and like if i'm getting this nervous on something like this i don't even want to think you know how people say like which even I do it sometimes, but like, let's say there's a, a tournament, like a football or something, and there's a rookie or some, like, some scrambles under a massive, like, pressure. It's easy to yell from home, but it's so hard to, like, actually learn how your mind works. Like, even if there's pressure, you need to somehow, like, not ignore it, but make it, like, it doesn't bother you. Hey, beta tester, what up? Don't go too near these corners, because they will suck you in. This one especially. I remember running into it. They didn't even go too that close. I just got voided, for fuck's sake. That's bad. That's six of the shimmies because I must blundered it. And the run is <laughs> meh. I mean, it's ahead. But I, I lost 20 seconds in. I lost 20 seconds in 40 fathoms, so this run would be in godlike. Without that.
Hey, Crashing Snake, thank you. Yeah, other than 40 Fathom, it's been very clean, I think. Oof, close. My camera didn't move enough somehow. Or it was really slow. I don't know, maybe I was just smoking. Yeah, 20 seconds, but if I can keep that uh, only massive time loss, then I think we can cook. But obviously, I would rather not have it. But it kind of takes away like the most, the biggest like pressure because I don't feel like it's that crazy run anymore, even though it's ahead. So it's, uh, you know. Hey, Crashing Snake. Thank you, thank you. But, I mean, they're still tippet and all these fucking levels going, so. <laughs> Nothing to root, like, celebrate yet. And as we saw it in my P. What? In my PB. Um, home Sweet Home can be really fucked up. And also, I don't know if you saw it, but I used some of the roll backwards on the slope and then jump twist. The game tries to, like, I, I would like them to remove the feature where the camera tries to correct itself. So, like, no matter how much camera I turn, the game doesn't realize it. Because the game itself is trying to fight against my turning. And I can't turn it off, so she just goes into the wall anyway. Even if I, like, camera angle wise, should have missed it. Or the amount of I turned my, my camera. You will see it best if you flick your camera, like, make it turn a lot, and then you save, uh, you load a game. When you load, your camera will not be rotated the way it should. It will spin, still thinking. Uh, when you before you load it, if that makes sense. So that's why when you reset this game, for example, like in oh nice, nice dude, uh -huh. is like when you reset the run and then you see me jump left or right randomly at the beginning of a great wall, it's because when I reset it, the camera was turning a lot. And then the game really keeps that fucking camera state or whatever memory for the next reset. It's quite disturbing sometimes. It should be fine, maybe. I can make one club hit, I think, and still survive the drop. Uh -huh. <clears throat> I'm gonna risk it. <sighs> yeah, I was pretty... I was pretty confident, but I wasn't 100% confident. <laughs> Ah, too early jump.
No, no, don't get boosted, please. Usually wh when I get stuck there, she gets like extra boost and flies into the pit. I was a bit scared. I mean, it is 100% better. I'm just nitpicking like a small details because they are fixable. At least I'm, I want to believe it. And I want the game to be smooth. And like, I don't know, maybe some of the stuff, like... Not every player, like, finds all the little weird stuff Modern has, but... You find pretty good things <laughs> when you play 300 and whatever hours I've had in... Modern alone, I mean... Yo, Filsk. What up? Ah, fuck you. My unconscious self said turn left and I started turning, which was like playing it too safe. That was cursing myself. Uh -huh. Yeah, I have like 440 something hours in this game in total. But maybe like 70, 80 hours was tank, if I remember correctly, I don't know. Let's say I have loads of hours on modern. I was so close to exploding. I didn't get the boost off the coroner. I know it's a name on it. Because uh -huh. it is viable, right? late Oh shit luck man I forget to draw guns so she didn't turn the way I wanted Oh do the side flip <laughs> Okay, okay Now it starts to meme rate hours when I started like pressing random keys. Yo, 
that was quite a pretty disgusting tibet, honestly. This is gold if if there's no like no big mistakes. Well, there's one. That's not a massive level. I still don't have fully clean level. It's so impossible for this. It's so long. Uh, sometimes it's because, um, well, it's not main, it's mainly not, like, jump inputs, so those are my fault, but, like, rolling sometimes is not because I'm, like, wanting to roll, it's because the game is thinking I want to roll when I burst up and down too fast, or camera is, like, forcing its fucking future on me. Yeah, I don't want that. I I despise that input combination. Why it's in the game. The fact it was kept in the game and put it in the game. And the same thing goes with the sidestep. Why is it that sidestepping with walk button is like good? It's so bad. Dude, I pressed E and up at the same time. <laughs> Fuck off. No gold coming. I don't mind if it's a thing, but like, keep. Especially because the game has PC port as well. Why not have them separate? Like, the true Tomb Raider 2. Like, OG, for example. Like, you know. Hey JH, what up, what up? I know the logic in Tomb Raider 3 onwards because you had so many inputs that it had to be tied into one. But it is... Uh, it's hard to describe the annoyance. It's not just the remaster. It's, I have talked about it 10 trillion times. In like tank especially, when you play in Tomb Raider 3 onwards, like 4 or 5, and then you have a pickup, right? And then you miss it by a tiny bit. But then you can fix it by sidestepping and turning left or right. But because you can't do it consistently, the games make game makes you actually sidestep the opposite way because that's how you turn, Lara. That drives me insane. Fat fuck go away. No, I don't think it should matter. Like, give us option, more options to uh, choose from, customize it. No? You are stuck with a walk. It is the only way. Basically a forced face fuck. I mean, what? <laughs> Come on, monk. You can do it.
Well, I don't know the controls because I don't use controller, right? Dude! I am so far behind this level. Yeah. I don't know why it wouldn't be allowed. I'm allowed to use mouse rebinding tool like Steel Series or Corsair IQ, which I'm using. I'm not using macros, but maybe the sidestep thing goes under this macro because of the. It's getting rid of a key press. Yeah, I think macros are stupid anyway. Yeah, it still doesn't get rid of the core issue I have with the input. Uh -huh. The core issue is simply... Some movements are so precise and... Like, it's impossible. But I don't use tanks, so no, no need to worry. Loki, we are on a run. There's little time saves, I think, in the later game as well. <laughs> Pretty nice run, honestly. The first day back. After, like, what? Yo, Falco, what up? Low health though, because I failed to jump a bit. You might say, oh, I didn't, I survived, it didn't fail, it failed. I landed right on the edge of the window, which loses more health. So I'm gonna preemptively heal once. Because most likely I will get hit here, or... Um, the... The guys, so... Next level is very, 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 very telling how this run is gonna go, like, time-wise. Ah, come on. Because, uh, next level has some, some things. Mainly the two guys RNG, how they're gonna... Oh my fucking god, dude. He was testing my... Moves. Monks have been really blocky today. Not because of the shape, but they've been blocking me. Yeah, not the greatest. 
into like a bang average ski hop. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. I am now a cat. Fails. Isn't is there a saying in you in British where it's like, to be honest, you are Scottish, so you are not even British, but. <laughs> Wind your neck in. Isn't that a saying in the UK? I don't know what giraffe just <laughs> reminded me of it. <laughs> yeah, okay. Nice. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> it's a song. To me, it's funny because I. That fucking giraffe comment, like. Made me think of it. <laughs> hey, Liam. What up? No, oh, come on! Dude, I just wasted that fucking small med. I healed preemptively because I was like, surely I will get hit. And then I get an RNG where they're not even close. Come on! Move north, nice. Do you already have snow though? It's not really the best year for snow yet, at least. But like, very north has it, but not... It's been really... Yeah, it's like very uncomfortably warm recently, but... Usually when this happens, the fucking winter is like... Minus 40 for three weeks again, like last year. I golded it, even with these bonks. What? I actually know what. I forgot the, the pickup skip still. <laughs> nice. A second gold. I was over second... A second. Six seconds behind at the trap door for, uh, from my old gold. When I went to the last key area. So even if it's a goal, it's not like a banger. But it's a goal, so you know, context doesn't matter anyway. Hey that Ruin, what up? I pressed fucking large by accident! I hope that doesn't bite me in the arse. Hey, score bunny, what up? Fuck 
fuck you, Filsk. <laughs> You're a little disgusting. Oh, that's good. Oh my god, I predicted when he dies perfectly. I was putting the gun away and then after that he died. <laughs> that was like actually too perfect. Okay, lock in, lock in, lock in. Oh my days. Please have mercy on me. They are not having fucking mercy on me. Aim the nipple, aim the nipples, stamp on second, stamp on second. Oh yes. So jump on second, jump on second. Dude, that was like one of the best catacombs I've had in a long ass fucking time. Okay, lock in, lock in, lock in, lock in. Dude, I fucking let go of up. I'm not locked in. Also, that one I think is different on cons, uh, not console, the, the controller and PC. I'm pretty sure that's different. Um, what I mean by that is, I'm pretty sure in control, with controller you can instant, like, you don't need to wait Lara to stop and then shimmy. You can just instantly hold right, bump keyboard at least. He keeps the up input momentum still. <laughs> Maybe, but let's not get ahead of ourselves. Still a lot to go. <laughs> that should still be enough. I hope it's enough. I don't have meds to fucking spare, dude.
It has to be enough. Hey, Ashley. Hey, Fahrenheit, what up? Hey, Sakit. Hey, Philippe, thank you. <laughs> that is the worst fucking possible way. You actually have to fight against Lara not jumping down. <laughs> it's kind of scary. The closer you get the doorway, it's the scarier to get. Thank God. Oh, I don't have flare. I forgot. That's why she grabbed it.
Oh, yes, that's scary. That jump is the scariest in the level. I just need to stay focused. I have healed, I have healed, I have healed, I have healed, I have healed.
It's about next level. Please, for the love of God. Yes! Oh, I have to go around. I have no meds. Yes, 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 yes! I had to take a little sacrifice, not go through them, because I can get permanently stuck. Now I'm nervous. Really nervous. I, my camera got stuck. Please, please, come on, come on, yes. Yes, yes, yes. <clears throat> come on, where's the pistol dudes, come on. Club guys. This is perfect. That is like the most godlike Tom Sweet Tom RNG. Jesus Christ. Fuck sake, I heard. Oh my god, I finally executed the RNG spawn perfectly. Fuck yes! Woo! Imagine without the 20 seconds in 40 fathoms. This is insane. My God. That is the most insane run I've ever had on this game. Holy. First of all, it's less than a minute off my summer best. And I lost 20 seconds in 40 fathoms. So for one hour and 30 minutes almost, I lost 30 seconds in other, every other level except 40 fathoms. That is ridiculous. Thanks for GG's, man. It is 
seems there's possible, but you... <laughs> How can I match my early? How many golds? Not too many, actually. Oh my god. Look at that. Oh. I can't believe it. I had four golds. The Mario Doria was like... 0.1 second gold or something. Monastery was a second. Floating Island uh, was like few. And Home Sweet Home, I said it. If I can get a good Home Sweet Home, I can save so much time. But my god, when I saw them run inside, I was staying inside the house and blocking the view on the left because I know if I can kill the right, the last guy, the last, very last dude, will spawn right next to me. Oh! Yeah, it was first run of the day. Well, not literally. I failed twice in Venice, but... There's always a way. I'm not. Oh my god. We can, yeah. Oh, hey, Gui. I haven't felt this adrenaline rush in a long ass time. I haven't not had a BB where I'm actually so happy. I didn't even want to say it after 40 fathoms, but I was thinking if I can ace the, the rest of the game, this can still be a really good run. But I never thought this home sweet home would fucking cook this run. This is simply from home sweet home. Is this the world record? Yeah, easily, by 43 seconds. <laughs> because it was my before, as well. Woo! Okay. We can go back the run. Oh.